Okay, we're back for more part two. As of yet, we have not seen any Supercorp, which I'm not thrilled about, but let's continue. The transition is harder on you than I thought. A beginner's mind is a zen mind. I hate her. Maybe if you supported your fellow journalists instead of competing with them, you wouldn't be such a, a, a jerk. Do it. I don't like this. This is like there. This is like the traditional heteronormative you know, progression of like, like, you know, angry banter, like, blah, 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 good, like, blah, 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 why don't you go out with me? What? Like, the black card is charity. I wanted to do it. I liked doing it. Lena. Oh. I'm drunk. Oh, something Lena did. And then also, she's like getting to the point where she's like having. Eve or like using the waves to have Eve admit that she like liked hurting people How'd maybe? What will your shareholders think? Or the world? Why don't you just leave her alone, honey? Oh, and I, I know how valuable they are to you. How many hours you spent in them? You're cut off. What? Keep screwing with me and you won't just owe me a story. You'll be the story. What the fuck? I hate her. She's coming at all of my queens. She's trying to ruin Kara's career. She's trying to ruin Lena's career. Can she step back? Because she will have the full force of Supercorp army behind Lena and Kara trying to kill her. Thank you. Random person that we've never met before. Nia. Stupid buddy comedies and Taylor Swift and <laughs> quiet nights in. You know she does. I love that too. So you'll chill on the food? Indeed. Consider me chilled. Thank you, Nianal. Over and out. Yeah, I appreciate you letting me be here. Shouldn't you be working? Oh, please. You are a welcome distraction. This girl has left work three separate times today. I kind of get it. <laughs> if I was her boss, I'd be like, hello? <laughs> you know who I feel bad for? His wife. Because uh, she's stuck with him. John, I don't know how much longer I can last at Catco. I mean, listen, the moment Cat Grant left should have been you out the door, okay? Seriously. Wait, oh no, someone's gonna attack Alex. They're gonna attack Kelly? As Alex? Yep. Here it is. Hey. Oh god, no, stop messing with my kids. You're the real hero. Almost catching Sean's brother. <laughs> <laughs> like the most awkward a hand touch of all time. How did you manage to track him? Yeah, she's like, what? What is that stiff hand? That's that stiff, clammy hand that's touching me. I still have some of that blueberry pancake batter in the fridge, so how about I whip some of those? Sounds good. Uh huh. Ooh. Thanks. Oh my God, we stand. Ooh. <laughs> Kelly's like, wait, why don't I have one of those? I must have just bumped in. No, she's the green. Ooh, she had to zap her sister in the face. That wasn't very nice. <laughs> Kyler, oh my god. Woo! We love Kyler's stunt double. Imagine just like being in National City, like living your life and like, well, first of all, I love this. I love them fighting. You know, this has happened before. They've, oh, they're always fighting when Alex is under the influence of something. But imagine just living in National City and being like, oh, they're fighting right here. Time to leave. Oh my God, they rode in on a motorcycle together. I swear. Wait, who was she on the, oh, it was, it was James. I literally thought it was Alex. Oh, Back in the closet. <laughs> no pun intended. Oh my god, she's like, yes, it is you. I can touch, I can feel your hand, your pulse, I know it. Honestly, like, at this point, just straight up tell Kelly that Kara is Supergirl because everyone knows. I feel like we can, oh my god, trust Kelly. Oh my god, she's gonna have to be like, I know you, ugh. Shoot him. Literally, what if you were wrong? <laughs> Somebody caught her, thank God. Oh, we planted a bug. 
William? Okay, thanks. Cookies. <laughs> oh, hey, I got you a little gift. Oh, oh my God, bless. What is it? So this is a list of my allergies. Blueberries, hazelnuts, bees, and caps. Wow, she's really allergic to like three of the biggest okay, nuts, berries, and bees. This is very helpful. Thank you. Know about each other. And, you know, I really freaking like you <laughs> a lot. And selfless choice. I knew exactly in that moment which one of you was my Kelly. Oh my god, so cute. Literally, I'm falling in love with them. I like them a lot. I I can't wait till Kelly is a little bit more well-rounded. I already love Alex, clearly. But like, I'm feeling it. Every little detail, but I know you. Aww, it's so sweet, isn't it? <laughs> that was a little bit disingenuous, that, that, that weird whatever, but you know, it's fine. Dearest Nina. Sometimes you are the dumbest, smartest person I know. Ah, the babies. Where's Supercorp? Not in this episode, apparently. Just like last season, where Lena's off doing her own fucking lab thing, Kara's off doing her own you thing. I decided that it's time to fill you in on what I've been doing. You can count on me for real this time. You must have made a hit my dad's. She's gonna kill her or something. I've been mapping my mind. You need to locate and highlight the centers of your brain that trigger honesty and loyalty. So hope knows where to go. Oh my god, she's putting the AI into Eve. <laughs> I love it. Oh, Lena, that's so fucking morally corrupt, though. Aw, babies. Oh, she's unhappy. She's doing her best. Brainy just needs to just like chill slightly. Just dial it down, dial it down. Oh my God, slow motion strut. I also sent you 11 pitches ahead of tomorrow's meeting, all with eye grabbing headlines and image options. Don't be late. Andrea is a bitch, but like, she's kind of like a Miranda Priestly bitch where she is like, I mean, she did elevate Cara's performance by, you know, expecting a lot from her and by kind of giving her a little kick down when she thought she could just run all over the place, which like, ooh, I kind of get it. But she's a bitch and she's clearly a villain. Oh, great. So now we see that he's secretly like a really good person and that Kara's gonna wanna bang him. And we can justify that because he's a good person because he's working at the homeless shelter. Sure. Oh my God, it's hope. Oh my god, Carolina Dean. <laughs> Together we can rebuild humanity. Why does Lena do this this weird Lena's so weird. <laughs> Every time she has like a traumatic personal experience, she like dives into her fucking professional life and like tries to like create the next coming of Jesus or something. So that was a good episode. Um, I'm a huge Hope slash Hope Eve stan now. Um, I like the AI. I think the AI is cute. I feel like maybe the AI will become slightly, you know, evil in the future, but who knows? I, I'm glad that they found a way to reincorporate Eve sort of back into the fold of this season. Again, no Supercorp in this episode, even though I got him out for this occasion after finding him, weirdly, in a weird place. Yeah, no Super Corp, and especially on the heels of that premiere where there was so much angst and tension between them, it kind of felt like we didn't follow up on that immediately afterward, which again is where I feel Supergirl, the writing struggles a lot, is just kind of like letting these things fall through. Not to the point where they're like mentioned so that we at least get a taste, so that we're still compelled to find out what's gonna happen, but like drop to the point where we don't, we like forget what happened and then we're like, oh yeah, like way later on. Not that anyone would forget that this thing was happening between Supergirl and, or Kara and Lena, but I just feel like it's a real big tripping point for them letting these storylines story slip through the cracks and completely fall to the wayside to the point where we just don't care about them anymore. And then once they try to decide to finally bring them back after having not teased them in a few episodes, we're just like, oh yeah, this was happening. Or at least that's my opinion about it. But anyway, like I said, it was a great episode. I love the whole AI integration into Eve. I'm not for this 
William character. I just think it's another attempt at pairing Kara off um, with somebody. I can already see the little seeds being sown of their relationship. Um, another attempt to unsuccessfully pair Kara off, which nobody asked for. And Kelly and Alex's storyline is coming together very nicely. A lot of like things that I wasn't expecting and I am falling for them a little bit. I'm starting to love them even more. And I'm just glad that Alex is happy and that's really great. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching. Please follow me on Twitter, subscribe to this channel and check out my Patreon you know what to do. I will see you guys back here for potentially the second episode of Batwoman if you know I can get around to it. And then if not, I will see you guys back here next week for Supergirl episode three.